In Greek mythology, it was said that the gods condemned Sisyphus to repeat a meaningless task for all eternity. His task was to endlessly push a boulder up a mountain, only to have it roll down again. French existentialist and Nobel Prize winning author Albert Camus saw the situation of Sisyphus as a metaphor for humanity. He asked the question, how can we find meaning in this absurd existence? As humans, we are toiling endlessly, building for a tomorrow that never arrives and then we die. If we truly realize this truth, then we will either go mad if we are identified with our egoic personas, or we will awaken and become free We can never succeed in the outer struggle because it's just a reflection of our inner world. The cosmic joke, the absurdity of the situation becomes clear when there's a complete and utter failure of the egoic self to awaken through its futile pursuits. As in the movie The Matrix, we could all be hooked up to some elaborate program feeding us an illusory dream world. In the movie, humans lived out their lives in the matrix, while on another level, they were merely batteries, feeding their life force to the machines which used their energy for their own agenda. always want to blame something outside themselves for the state of the world or for their own unhappiness, whether it's a person, a particular group or country, religion, or some kind of controlling Illuminati, like Descartes' evil demon or the sentient machines in the Matrix. Ironically, the demon Descartes envisioned was the very thing that he defined himself by. When you realize Samadhi, it becomes clear that there is a controller. There is a machine, an evil demon leeching your life day after day. The machine is you.